On the scene, on the story, this is News 9. Interesting story here. Some new life for what's become an old eyesore on the city's northwest side. And that new life is bringing some new popularity. News 9's Aaron Brillbeck is on the story for us. Aaron? Yeah, back in its heyday, the old Tiffany apartment building was the pinnacle of modern living in Oklahoma City, but time has taken its toll over the years until now. The year was 1967. Dr. King was preaching peace, the space race was in full speed, and the Tiffany apartments were built on Oklahoma City's northwest side with its eight-foot-tall Tiffany sign serving as a landmark. But age took its toll on the 94,000-square-foot building. Fast forward to today, the building has gotten a $25 million facelift, restoring it to its 1960s grandeur. We had to take it back to its original structure, but still keep the the characteristics, the, the character that it had from the beginning. So when, when you do that, you just really have to pay attention to what it was previously before you make it new. Today, the building boasts a 60s feel with the original mosaic and nostalgic furniture, but it also has modern conveniences like a gym, a saltwater pool, and a green-friendly appeal. It has a passive geothermal system, which basically uses the ground temperature to passively heat and cool the building. It's incredibly energy efficient, very affordable, very unique. Um, we have electric vehicle charging stations on the property. Apartments started about $1,200 per month and include a combination of modern and retro features. Owners said the building just had so much character, so much personality, they just couldn't level it. To be able to preserve something that has history and so many people in Oklahoma City remember either living in or visiting, uh, that's really rewarding and I think people respond to it. So it was, I think it was worth it. Now, if you're interested in moving in, you better act fast. The building opens up in August and already it's 25% rented with uh, people renting it sight unseen. We're live on the scene on the story on the city's northwest side, Aaron Brillbeck, News 9. Let me tell you, I can remember that used to be a real destination place to live. Really? And so it looks looks yeah. like they've done a great job on it. It's right by Dave and Buster's at May Avenue. Oh, yeah. And right North there, North Express. Yep, right there. Yeah. Cool, man. Right really there. nice. They, they made some changes. Yeah.